Hello, and welcome. Look around you. This is a ghost world. The air is hot and humid, the sky is often hazy, and the once vibrant oceans are eerily quiet. We are standing at the dawn of the early Triassic period that began a little over 250 million years ago. This isn't a world of mighty dinosaurs or lush jungles. This is what's left after the greatest catastrophe in Earth's history. The event's so complete, it's simply known as the Great Dying. A blank canvas, imagine, a blank canvas. Over 90% of all life in the oceans, and 70% of life on land was wiped out. The rulers of the previous age, the mighty Gorgonopsians, were gone. The diverse insect life. Vanished. The coral reefs. All that's left are fossils. For millions of years, the planet was a scorched wasteland. There were few places to hide and even fewer things to eat. Survival was a daily struggle. The creatures that lived here weren't just the lucky ones. They were the resilient ones. The dominant animals of this period were simple, yet powerful survivors. One of the most common was the Lystrosaurus, a small pig-like reptile with a tough beak. It wasn't fancy, but it could dig for roots in the arid ground and chew through almost anything. It was a testament to the fact that to survive, you didn't need to be the biggest or the fastest, you just had to endure. The rise of new life but the early Triassic wasn't just about survival. It was about the slow, painful process of rebirth. With the old ecosystems empty, evolution had a fresh start. This was the moment for new life to experiment and to fill the massive voids left by the extinction. New types of reptiles began to evolve, including the first archosaurs the group that would eventually give rise to the dinosaurs. They were still small and in the shadow of creatures like the Lystrosaurus, but they were adapting, getting stronger, and getting ready for what was to come. In the seas, a few species of fish and ancient marine reptiles managed to survive and began to repopulate the oceans. The world was still recovering, but the signs of life were everywhere, if you knew where to look. The beginning of a new age, the early Triassic, is a powerful reminder that even after the most devastating events, life finds a way. It's not a glamorous age of giants, but it is one of incredible importance. It is the story of a shattered world that began the long climb back to a state of rich, complex biodiversity. It's the prologue to the age of dinosaurs, and the first chapter in a story of a new dawn. Thanks for watching. If you want to continue the journey into the age of dinosaurs, be sure to like and subscribe.